Hey everyone, we're about to do a 15 minute full body sculpt workout with light dumbbells. We'll work your legs, arms, and especially your shoulders. You'll see a lot of bar inspired movements today. So if you love my bar arms workouts, then you will love this workout. All you'll need is a light set of dumbbells. So either three or five pound weights will do. So find a bit of space and let's get to it. All right, with dumbbells in hand, let's take those feet a little bit wider than hip width. We have squat, then cross overhead press. Inhale, exhale. Let's go. Down and cross and reach. Good. Really lengthen and sink nice and low in that squat. Good, keep those elbows lifted and bent to the side. All right, take a 15 second break. Palms facing up, we have a bicep curl. Flip palms down, flip palms up. Here we go. Curl. Good. Flip down, flip up. Really squeeze through those biceps. Good mind to muscle connection here. Good. Strong through that core, slight bend through those knees the whole time. All right, take a break. We have reverse lunge, so stepping back with the left foot. One, two, three, four. Then squat together. And you're sticking with that same leg for this interval. Here we go, so step back with the left. One, two, three, four. Punches, squat, lunge. Good, let's sink, sink even lower for both the squat and the lunge. Sink those hips. All right, take a second. And then you're gonna move to the other side so it'll be your right leg stepping back into that lunge. Here we go. Right leg steps back. One, two, three, four. And squat. We're not okay. I look into your eyes and see you fade away. You should be feeling it in those quads for this one. All right, take a breather. Next step. We have a deadlift with arms to the side. Slight bend through those knees. You're leaning forward, arms overhead, side. Come back up. Here we go. Get ready with a sturdy base. Lean forward, arms up, arms side. Come back up. Good, take this nice and slow and controlled. But as you lean forward, I want you to look down, lengthen the back of the neck, 
Good, the whole time those elbows are lifted and supported. Good, you should feel this in your back body as you lean forward. All right, that one burn. Step those feet nice and wide and turn out from the hips. We have wide second pulses with palms facing up. You're gonna press forward and back in. Okay, let's go. Press forward and in. Exhale, inhale. Good, pulsing nice and low. Good, brace through that core, drawing those ribs in. You've got it, shoulders down. Okay, take a break, but we are gonna keep the feet where they are. Next one, bend those elbows at 90 degrees to the side. You're going to do a wide second squat, cross punch, back to center, alternating sides. Here we go, cross punch and lunge, back to wide second. Good, take it slow. This one is a burner through those quads, through those shoulders. Good, keep those elbows up and lifted. A few seconds left. All right, for your next move, you're going to extend your right leg to the side, place that dumbbell on it, four pulses, and then side lunge. Oh, and also, this arm is out to the side for that extra burn. Here we go. Pulse. Two, three, four. Lunge. Up. I don't know about you, but that side shoulder is on fire. I don't know if I can make it. We can do it. Keep that arm up. <laughs> Drop that arm. Take that break. Then you're gonna do the other leg, so it should be your left leg up. Do little pulses here. So you're really working into the side glutes. Get ready, place the dumbbell on there. Let's go. Pulse, really pulling up nice and tall. Whoop. And don't forget about that side arm. I almost did. Good, taking it slow. Come on, get taller. Good, out the top of that head here. Okay, take a break. Next up with palms facing up, you're gonna do knee, bicep curl, alternating legs. Front, let's go. Knee and curl. Good. Really squeeze those dumbbells as you curl. Squeeze. Good. Elbows stay at shoulder height. Good. Really use your abdominals to draw that knee up. 
Good, use that low core. All right, we have alternating lunges. You're gonna step back and same arm as leg is reaching overhead. So the leg that steps back is the same arm that goes overhead. Here we go. Lunge back together. Okay, for your next move, bend through those knees and lean forward slightly. You have top backs with palms facing in. You're gonna extend, bend. Good, tricep extensions. Here we go. So those elbows should be staying in the same spot the whole time. Really squeezing them back. Good, drawing those shoulder blades together. Squeeze, good. Good. Keep that upper body long. This is my favorite cue to say. Just want to lengthen the whole time. Okay, Whew. feeling it in the back of those arms. Next up, we're gonna take left leg forward here. Reach and pull with that knee. Gonna get the heart rate up with this one and pick up the speed. Here we go. Reach and pull. Draw those elbows wide to the side. It burns. Okay, take a break, then we'll do the other side. Right leg forward, driving that knee in. Here we go. Let's move. Good, I know that those shoulders are probably burning by now. I'm probably tempted to drop those elbows, but don't do it, because this workout is only 15 minutes. So you can keep them lifted, keep pushing through, find it within yourself. All right, this is your final move. You're gonna press those dumbbells together, find a squat, step out wide, press forward, step together, and you're gonna alternate sides. Here we go. Okay, so you're creating that pressure between the dumbbells by pressing them together. You should feel it in those shoulders, but also in the chest muscles. Squeeze them together. Good. 
Good, sink low, 10 seconds. Woo, you made it. All right, if you enjoy that workout, then smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, and comment below. Let me know if you want more light dumbbell workouts like this one. I'm proud of you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.